How you doing? Thanks for watching. This is George with Wicked Warnings here with an awesome build. A big bad F-350 dually customized by Ford and a company called Black Ops. And then it was brought here for lighting through a local Ford dealer. We've got our LIN-6 up on the top of the grill under the hood. We've got our TIR-3 in the fog pocket bezel as well as under the rear tail light. It's also featuring our Wicked Warnings mirror mod kit. A little bit better front on shot. There you go, you can see that mirror mod there. I know, we should have did the C-rings. Believe me, if I could have, I would have. Squirrel shot. All right, let me turn around and show you the back. That is a nice ass. Look at them tires. Out back, we're running our LED HAW Duo. We did have to remove the two factory LEDs that uh, are normally mounted in the cargo. There is a video on that. Uh, in order to put a strobe in that third brake light, such as this, on a Lariat with an LED in the factory cargo location, you just have to remove the little circuit boards to make room for the strobe. On the reverse lights, we have a custom shop mod right now that I'm going to try to make available for sale to wigwag the factory reverse lights. There's no way to get a strobe that is worthwhile to inside the factory reverse light at this point, but wigwagging the factory doesn't cause any damage and gives you a nice white alternating flash. You can see here we've uh, got our TIR3 under the rear tail light in the popular spot there and that's synchronized with the front. All four of the TIR3s are actually synchronized together so uh, the corner lighting per se on all the sides uh, side facing flashes all at the same time and then we've got the remaining patterns set up the way we did. On this particular truck, these are all fed off the factory auxiliary switches, and we've set up one of those auxiliary switches to run the steady burn feature of the cargo light, so the customer does still have the ability to have the cargo light as a bed light. As you can see here, you can steady burn the cargo light at any time, with or without the strobe operation, and yes, the reverse lights will work as they work normally. If you put the truck in reverse, the lights are going to go steady. I'll show you. Hang on. Okay, just so everybody's clear, they're strobing right now. And as you can plainly hear by Ford's audible warning and the door open there, it's in reverse and they're steady burning and, uh, oh no, it's going to roll away. No, this behemoth isn't going to roll anywhere. Back to the park position and back to the disco action. And if we turned off the steady burn up top, we return back to full party on mode. So, thanks again for watching this George at Wicked Warnings. When brand new Black Ops Edition F-350 Dually. I'm not going to show you the sticker tag on the windshield. Nobody needs to see that. Thanks again for watching. Oh my God!